He's probably taking that money that you give him and enjoying it with his main chick. Really? <laughs> Ask her, when is her date with the man of her dreams and send her money for outfit? Hey guys, what's a pop? What's popping gang gang? It's your girl Umpile and I'm back at it with yet another video. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, you know what it is, you know what it do. In today's video, I'm going to be solving your guys' dilemmas. I'm going to be solving your guys' musunari situations. I'm going to be solving your clownary situations baby so a couple of days ago i asked people on instagram to send me their musunari situations and a few people participated so i just want to say thank you guys so much for participating this guy and i have been together for a year only to find out that i am his side during our time together he sold me dreams and i helped him with some capital to start his business i broke up with him and i won my money back but he's refusing to give it to me let me tell you something that your friends won't tell you that money is gone baby it's gone it's gone it's gone money that you give up when you are digmatized <laughs> rarely comes back <laughs> trust me i know <laughs> If you have receipts, if you have um, text messages, if you had like, if you generally have proof, you can take him to court. But also, that might also just cost a little bit of money. Honestly, it is up to you what you wanna do with it. But I'm just gonna tell you the truth: the money is gone, and it's not coming back. <laughs> hey, Ubile, I am in love with my boyfriend's ice boy, but I'm skeptical to leave to leave my boyfriend because I care about him and I know he loves me. I've been saving up on the side because the ice boy and I have a plan to build up a good life using the current boyfriend's money. What should I do? Let me tell you something, baby. The ice boy is pimping you out. <laughs> He's probably taking that money that you give him and enjoying it with his main chick. <laughs> Greener pastures. They only happen once in a blue moon, baby. They don't happen to all of us. It's only going to bite you in the ass, baby. You're going to lose everything. Let's just say, for example, you and the ice boy decide that you're going to break up with him because isn't now you are both in a relationship with him. Do you think that ice boy can really maintain you? Think about it. Right now, your boyfriend doesn't even know and he's maintaining the both of you. So the ice boy can't even, can even maintain one of you. So don't you think that break up with the ice boy it's not worth it your boyfriend loves you imagine he loves you enough that you he gives you so much money that you have enough to share with your side nigga you also you are a clown because why are you doing this to your boyfriend you're, you're messed up don't do that i just found out that my man made my childhood my childhood friend pregnant what should i do i feel like this situation needs more context does your friend your childhood friend know that you and your man are together does your did your man know before he decided to cheat on you that you and your childhood friend were friends generally speaking unless if the baby mama did it intentionally to to, to just kind of like ruin things between you and your man let it go um especially on the baby mama's point of view your man cheated on you and that's that so you figure out how you want to deal with that do you want to break up with him do you want to you know do you want to stay with him it's up to you really what do you want to do hey my boyfriend told me that one of my friends is hitting on him in the dms i don't know what i should do should i confront the girl or should i just let it slide and play and let her play herself thinking that i don't know baby this one she deserves just a <laughs> just a hot varam clap oh hot one just a varam clap you know let me tell you something this one <laughs> There are so many ways to play the situation. These are the kind of games that I like. These are the kind of games that I enjoy. You can let it slide, obviously, right? And pretend like you don't know. But I don't advise. That's not my style, baby. Baby, if you guys are friends, like how you're saying, you guys probably meet a lot, like out in public. Timing is everything. Wait for a situation where you guys are having like a young conversation, especially about relationships and stuff. When you're right, the opportunity always presents itself. And then just say to her, but listen, you're hitting on my man. 
L let it drop in her guts. You know that feeling when 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 something happens and something happens is also in your stomach. <laughs> when some when when someone confronts you and something in your stomach it just drops. You you, you know that feeling. You can give her that feeling. Ultimately, she just needs a faram. It's up to you. And then this one says, Hey Umpile, so I met this guy here in China and I really like him. The other day when we were talking about pretty girls in China, he mentioned your name. And so I want this guy, but he is out here checking for you. So what should I do? Hey! <laughs> is this real? If it's checking for me, you know I like my options. <laughs> I'm kidding. Honestly, just tell me. Shoot your shot, baby. Shoot your shot. A friend of mine went and called my mom back in Tanzania, and I and told her that I am basic. I'm basically a loose cannon here in China. So what should I do? This one, you know, also deserves a varam. Just a young. I don't care how close we are, baby. You do not call my mom without my permission. The fuck you doing calling my mom? The fuck? Are you mad? Are you crazy, bruh? Think a dirty mouth can come and talk to my mom? Are you mad? I wish a bitch would. I wish. That's disrespect on a whole new level. Unless you are in a hospital and they need one of your friends to call your mom, there is absolutely no reason any of your friends is allowed to call your mom, your dad, your grandparents, your siblings. Nobody deserves a just a young booze bass. This girl keeps on asking me to buy her airtime slash data. And I do because I really like her, but every time I try to call her, she doesn't text, she doesn't text back or answer. She only sends me text messages when she wants something. She makes up silly excuses just so that I can buy her data or airtime. Baby boy! Let me tell you. You continue buying her data. Let me tell you. Because, because. You are helping her find the man of her dreams. You <laughs> are doing God's work. You keep on buying her data. Don't stop. Don't stop being a clown. Don't stop now. Why do you want to stop now? Maybe her and the man of her dreams, right? Because of your data. You know, they've developed conversations that, you know what? Things are moving. Marriage is coming. Don't stop doing the right thing, baby. Continue. Continue being a, a good Samaritan. What more do you want? Also, do the right thing. Send their money for outfit. Send their money for outfit. Ask her, when is her date with the man of her dreams? And send their money for outfit. Because you're already doing such a wonderful job. Don't stop now, baby. Don't stop now. You are doing the Lord's work. God bless you, <laughs> brother. <laughs> okay, guys. So this is the end of our video. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you guys can come back again and watch more videos. Subscribe to the channel. Invite more of your friends. Share, 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 guys. Share everywhere on Instagram, on Twitter. Do the right thing. Help a sister out. Let's get those 100k, 100,000, this, 100,000, that. You understand what I'm trying to share? So, yeah, thank you so, so, so much for watching, babe. Mm -hmm.